So everyone is talking about this uh, Noah Syndergaard uh, signing with the Los Angeles Angels on a one-year deal uh, for $21 million. I'm going to tell you this right now. I was surprised when I read about it, and I am listening to it on the radio. Um, I heard from Yankee sources that the Yankees were keeping tabs on Thor. Uh, he was a free agent with a considerable upside, although there was no chance that they would have paid that much. So... As much of a setback as Synagogue's departure is for the New York Mets, it really increases the focus on the Yankees' search for that number two starter. And, of course, you know, Justin Verlander is on the radar. Um, if you watch guys like P. Simonetti, uh, they were talking about that. So, I, I talked about that, you know, in my podcast the other day about... Justin Verlander, would they give Justin Verlander a three-year deal, um, especially with a guy coming off of Tommy John surgery, and you don't know how he's going to do with that whole post spite attack stuff, so, I mean, it, it's not possible for Justin Verlander to uh, end up in the Bronx, so we'll see what happens, and that's just my take on this whole uh, Noah Syndergaard move. So uh, let me all know what you think in the comment section down below. I'm out. Peace.